So those people are actually our very good example. So assisting Buddha name chanting when dying is a good thing. Whether they can successfully get rebirth, it depends on if the dying spirits would like to go. The person who assists them can't decide it. If it is can decided by the person who assists them, it's, it's, it's even better, but it, it, it won't happen in this way. The Buddhas and Bodhisattva are those are so merciful, but even though they can't force them, force the being to go to the wasteland, this would not, this can't happen like this. This is, things doesn't work in this way, doesn't make sense. So we have to know this. The person, the human, share the same heart, and the heart go into the same logic, then we can't get deceived by others. We should really practice ourselves. The karma is real. And here, this is the key point here. Firstly, one has to realize the suffering in the six ways of reincarnation. We are not talking about this. There is overall suffering in the uh, only in the heaven, uh, only in the hell of the six realm. Now we are living in this world. I have the feeling that here is a human hell. Life is so suffering and the people live unhappily without joy. Even though someone has money, has priority in the society, but it's still like to taking the drug. To only let themselves lose the feelings of outside for a moment. This is not real happiness. To really understand the suffering in the sixth realm of reincarnation, one has to do it, has to understand. One has to learn after the bodhisattvas doing their way, not only solve their own problem, but also help all of the beings who suffer. This is correct. And inside of this, we choose one way out. Develop bodhisattva focus on one direction and concentrating in chanting and seeking rebirth in the pure land. Now we are capable of good roots, the virtue and merits of the karma. The most important is to is how we can overcome our affliction and our habits. This is a critical problem laid in front of us. How can we let go the illusion, the discrimination and attachment? If one can't, many can't let go. As long as this Buddha name, mindfulness, can control those things, 
to really achieve in overcoming the affliction to control that is to say bring the old karma without the new karma the new to go to the west then the, the karma which which uh, at present can be taken back to go to the west then why the person who is dying in his last moment could not be touched by anyone which is said by from the ancient masters and patriarchs they said they instructed us we can only touch their body but also their bed we should keep away from it never touch it why because to avoid to have them create affliction from it once they have any affliction they at present which is created they can't get rebirth this is strange common person after they stop breathing within eight hours the spirits are still with their body they have still have consciousness they have a they have feeling uh, feeling of consciousness when it's prolonged to mm, usually people make it to 12 hours in order to make it safe under 12 hours their spirits should have left should have already left their body the one who really achieve the level of chanting to get rebirth which is to say if they really achieve the level of consecutive mindfulness after they stop breathing they will leave at once that is so called real belief and sincere wish leave right after stop breathing For the person who has reached the level which is a little lower, but still to some extent, then they can achieve. If one, the person who totally has no ability to of mindfulness, can't achieve it. Or the person with the butchers from their past life. This also works in the way that the people assist them chanting and help them to trigger this culture out. Their spirits, it still takes some time for their spirits of those kind of person to leave their body this will be not so fast we can also confirm it's still within eight hours 12 hours is very safe afterwards one can touch them whether they really achieve rebirth and it is so important to know it as long as we try our best with heart and soul to help 
the um, the virtue is already fulfilled perfectly. If we really would like to know, to confirm whether the dying person died the person who left us already achieved rebirth as as you get rebirth there later, then you will know it yourself. You get rebirth in Westland, you can live there. If you if you wouldn't see them there, then they it was not successful. And whatever, wherever they have gone, you can also see it. You know it when you are in the wasteland. You will still take care of them and help them there. After achieving rebirth in the wasteland. You achieve our Yachu Bodhisattva and your ability is the same as on the Sutra described. Not only capable of the God I, the same as Bodhisattva Amitabha Buddha, but also the perfect brightness of the five eyes, the same as Buddha. You have to realize that to see rebirth in the wasteland is real. That makes sense. This is really happening. Your relatives and your friends in this way not only help the present friends relatives but also all of the pre all of the relatives in your past life but you still are thinking of il delusional things every day day and night still in the state of differentiate differentiating and attachment those are the Obstacles which is created by oneself. It is from the person who is keen on helping, assisting, chanting. This is good thing. They call on and propagate the merit of mm, Buddha name assist in chanting. This is a good deed. The ancient Chinese said good thing takes ups and downs. In this world the people who help to conduct bad deeds are many to the opposite the when people want to commit want to uh, make good deed there might not be so many people who would like to help instead might be some people who would like to set up obstacles so there were more difficulty in good deeds As long as we try our best, this is merit fulfilled. This is talk a lot in the Mahayana Sutra. One doesn't need to have differentiation in this point. We must try our best. So here, this paragraph. Show the biggest, the paragraph, the biggest inspiration on us is to let us, mm, to 
because there are more the sufferings in the world. Read Sutra more and then listen to the Sutra lecture more. In this way you can really understand the happiness in the baseline and understand how the Amitabha Buddha set up the other misbelief. He didn't make it based on his imagination, but on investigating all of the Buddha lands all over the Dharma realm and spaces. He took the advantage of them and led away the shortage of them. He did not take all of the no good, but take took all of the good thing, good thing. So the ultimate belief was setting up beyond all of the Buddha land. It works in this way. Does this make sense here? The all of the not so good things which described his from the vows exist in many Buddha lands. He witnessed that. Considering how to make it up, how to make, how to help successfully those beings who on the suffer and set up his great vows. This was the endless mercy of Buddha Amitabha. In the next paragraph, Master Chen Xian said, Holy. Holy misery. One can't see the bitter consequence of the beings in hell and hungry ghosts. One can't see the retribution of one's parents and teachers. So one has the very low heart, which would like to get out of this world. This here get tired of this world. One has the heart which is which is not so eager to get out of this reincarnation of six realm. their thought to give back gratitude to their parents is lagging behind. The ancient China said, if one is lagging behind, in good deeds and forget about himself of cultivation. The disaster, catastrophe will take place. This is the cause. That's why he will fail, fall down into the three pathways. 
to the opposite if we have the god eye which can help them to see the bitter consequences from hell from hungry ghosts and the retribution of our parents and teachers our attitude will get totally changed in Buddhism learning so long see that again the critical life lies in the eyes of God eye of up to seek the Buddhist way down to This is well said. Up to seek the Buddhist way down to help deliver the being. The most important to get tired of the suffering of the sad world. This is most important, especially in the sixth realm. How to get back gratitude of our parents and teachers? This lesson, seeking rebirth, really achieved by Buddha mindfulness to get rebirth into the West Land. In this way, you can really pay back the gratitude. To your parents and also to your teachers. Why? Wherever, which, where, whichever realm your parents and teachers are, can yes, they can. They have a very deep connection with you. Of course, you can. Firstly, go there. Firstly, go to look after them. No rest your land. One achieved the God Eye, which is same as Amitabha Buddha, which can help them see not only one to two lives, but also to hundreds of uh, not, not only hundreds of uh, lives. But also to the uncountable life before. Do we understand those people among those people? Some achieve Buddhahood, some Bodhisattva, some still stay in this. Three bad ways or six ways. In Westernism Buddhism, we said those are beings who have predestination with us. There are so many beings of this kind. And the second way, we, we finish the first mistake. Secondly, as in the recording of deed, it broadened the meaning. He, he explained, similar before, but more in detail. Like in the collection commentary said, Common people take this way of saying. They set off this vow. The heart of the vows of seeking rebirth in the Westland was set up 
does this tell me diminish the three bad ways to delay this getting rebirth in a wet way is the right way to get rid of the six six ways of reincarnation and six rebirth in a wet way get tired of the suffering sorrow and looking forward to the ultimate bliss in a pure land. In this way of describing, this is not only the benefit from the ultimate bliss world, the benefit in the ultimate bliss go far beyond this. Now, the real land referred to the real pure land, which is the West pure land. There were some pure land where there are saints beings with their they with that God I can see the three hundred word two hundred two thousand words four thousand words but um, can't see uncountable Buddha land where we already read those before. All of the Buddha, Buddhist, and Tathagata in the ten direction, three periods, all have the pure land. To which it is referred, it referred to the convenient resident that is the four sage dharma realm in a ten dharma realm four sage the dharma realm is pure land six ways refer to the unpure land the true retribution state Li land is called one true Dharma realm. That is real pure land where things are equal. But in the six four sage of Dharma realm is not equal. There are differentiation exists there in every Buddha land. And which is very huge. This is what we are describing in this paragraph. In the West Pure Land, it's different. The Pure Land, in his world, there are also the Convenient resident as the other Buddha land. But here, like in the, um, in other convenient resident, the beings can see two thousand to three thousand words with their god eye. 
Part number in the Shakyamuni Buddha's Pure Land of Lightning. But in the West Pure Land, the beings there from the same land of convenient rest land can see uncountable, unconceivable many Buddha lands. And meanwhile, the Bodhisattva in the fourth sage, the fourth sage Dharma realm, for example, from Shakyamuni Buddha's Buddha land, had also a capable of God I acceptance. It's not the God five eyes of perfection. And here, when one achieves, if one achieves Araha with the wisdom eyes, and when the Bodhisattva achieves their uh, Dharma eye without, instead of Buddha eye, but in the West Pure Land, when they beings get there, they achieve the five eyes of perfection and brightness. This can't be even mentioned at the same level. So this vow of Amitabha Buddha has the special meaning. In the Atomic Blue, not, not only in the Kalini Red Land, the beings are capable of those God eyes, but also in the Bonded Sage Joint Land, the beings also has have those kind of God eye with five eyes perfection because this is not mentioned in the vows that's the mounted mountain say John land it is an exception they didn't say it and we understand even the beings get rebirth into the lowest level which is the low low stage of the mountain sage joint land also achieve a capable of those benefits Do we believe this? If one don't, can't believe, this is called hesitation. If one has hesitation, then there is abstract of attachment, anger, ignorance, arrogance, and hesitation. Which, uh, in which hesitation referred to. One has, one's, one still has doubt about uh, what Buddha said. And the doubt is mostly a uh, obstacle of bodhisattvas. If one still towards, if we have 
not any doubt towards Buddha Bodhisattva and Sutras. Not only that you, we have uh, full good rules, Yeah, beings who are capable of the full good roots achieve faster. They don't have hesitation. And those kind of persons are called honest persons in Buddhism. The honest persons are easy to deliver and achieve faster. The most difficult now is called the intellectual. They have many doubts, many questions for any question they would like to break it into the bottom. But if, if they really understand what is talked, it's not necessary. Their doubt can't be cut off. One should know there exists originally no questions. The questions are all created by oneself. One look for trouble oneself. Why someone has no questions? If one really understand the things appears originates from the heart and they change according to the consciousness, then the questions are cut off at once. The compilation contemplation on the delusion and, and original appears is not well understood. Why? With doubt, they can't understand it. The persons with, without doubt, when once they read, they understand really, they really get benefit. The person without doubt cultivates in the pure land direction. Whichever get rebirth, everyone get rebirth. The kind of person can't get rebirth even with the assistance of Buddha chanting. Why? Because of the doubt. Person still has keep doubt towards the sentence in of the teaching, which is called, which is a uh, can't, which happens as as naturally for the intellectuals. In the primary phase, when we learn Buddhism, was not really easy. My teacher, Mr. Lee, took pains to teach me. I really feel re appreciation why he took pains, because I just can't, couldn't believe the doubt I have for the sutras that is the doubt of translation from where 
from the ancient language. For example, we read one article from the ancient time that ten people learn this or them this article and then learn it so well that they can recite it and then let them translate them in the in the modern language. The t it might be the case that a ten person translation translate into ten different forms, but which convey the real meaning of the original article. The sutras which were said by the Buddhas were delivered to China. How much real meaning of the Buddha can be translated into the Chinese language? I couldn't believe that it can be totally perfect, perfectly translated into Chinese. You see, this is the larger thinking of, the, of us. Always, I had this, I think, I thought that would be a problem. I have this question, and then the teacher answered me. He said, at that time, the Chinese has the real merit, which can be comparable with foreigners. Those masters who translated the sutras in ancient China achieved at least the three fruits. The sages, which translated the sutras, achieved at least the third levels of fruits, which is anaha. They were not common persons. In another word, they have cultivation and also the achievement. There were also many Buddha get reversed the here who show in the form of Patriarchs and masters, and the big bodhisattva who get reversed here, for example, Mahasri Bodhisattva, son of Padra Bodhisattva, Avalokitesvara, and Grand Power Bodhisattva. They are all then presented in the event of translation. How wonderful merit does this in a teacher Fang Dongwei who gave the higher concentration confidence to me.